Hey everybody, Jeff here. Welcome back to Dishonored. Oh wow, it's been... It's been like a month since I last recorded anything for this game. Um, let's see, uh, Life is Strange 2 Episode 5 came out in the beginning, just like December 3rd. Yeah, it was it was sometime in November. <laughs> so it's been, it's probably been over a month since I sat down to record this. Um, but it's good to be back. Uh, okay, what were we doing? We were, we are, we are clearing weepers out from the sewers underneath the hound pits. That's what we're doing, I believe. And I believe if we're like, we're, there's not much left of these sewers. I think they're right over here. What's crouch? Is this crouch? Oh, good. Okay. Um, what's my lean? There's my lean. And there's a weeper. Okay. There's two. Great. Oh, he's not doing great. He's he's not doing good at all. Um, the audio might be weird on this. I don't know. I I can't find my uh, recordings or my records for what the audio used to be when I recorded this originally. So sorry. <laughs> oh, don't look! Don't look! Don't, don't, don't. Okay, let's put you to sleep because you're even though you're infected and a weeper and basically just a monster we can't hurt you or kill you because it'll count against our no kill so you actually you know what you he looks pretty comfy right there right he's just resting against that I, the, okay the pipes probably not the best but I mean you know it's better than being in the river or sewer stream waterway <laughs> which if they did if they fell in there it would count as a death and I would have to re uh, reload. Um, an ancient note. I'm sorry, but I won't be here for the next meeting, or ever again, for that matter. What happened here was unnatural and makes me sick to recall. I left the result of our labors here for you to keep, but I expect that the rats will consume it before you return. Goodbye. Well, somebody's in a pissy mood. I'll take that though. Thank you. Happily, take that. Um, what's down here? Well, hold on, heart. Anything? Oh, 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 oh. Oh, we would have missed that. <laughs> Give me, there we go. Okay. Ooh, did I just kind of melt through the floor there? Oh, right, let's see here. Um... I guess we head back to Havelock? What's down here? I don't think there's anything else to worry about. Uh, although, we did... <laughs> oh. Well... No, I'm not, not going up there. Um, we did open that, that tunnel, or that gate. And I'm a little worried. Because I can't go back and undo it now. Uh, where was it? Hold on. Yeah, over here. I'm a little concerned because, on the one hand, um, like when we opened this and I went out there, my my immediate concern was bitey bitey mean fish. Now I'm worried about more weepers coming in, but there's no. I can't close it, and I can't confirm that. Or I haven't. I shouldn't say I can't. I haven't bothered to <laughs> look online and confirm that uh, Weepers won't sneak through there. So, I'm just gonna pretend that everything's fine and we're gonna keep going. Also, they really ought to cover this hole up. This would be a good idea. Hi, you, ooh. You went down there in the sewers? I thought I heard a Weeper in there earlier. You're probably the bravest man I've ever met. I mean, I don't, Martin oh. He's with Admiral Havelock now. They want to talk to you. I didn't want to brag, but I would have liked the opportunity to brag. Ugh, fine. Okay. Havelock! What's up? Guys in your fancy jackets making me... Well, actually, I don't know what kind of jacket we're wearing. I trust you remember Martin, an overseer before and perhaps again someday soon. Yeah, I saved I him. you thanks. For my rescue. Indeed. You've given us a glimmer of hope, Corvo. Because we've gotten what we wanted from Campbell's journey. You've done it. We know where Emily Caldwin is being held. 
the Golden Cat, of all places. A bathhouse for aristocrats. Little better than a cursed brothel. But there's an unfortunate twist. So when you say cursed, is it like haunted, or are you just being judgmental? Custis. Not only are they controlling Emily, but they have the controlling parliamentary votes we so desperately need. Yes, the Pendletons have to die. But most importantly, where did, Emily wait, where did Havelock must go? Her safely so we can protect her until the Lord Regent and his entourage have been dealt with. Pendleton's waiting for you on the dock. He's asked to brief you personally. I think it's best. Oh, that's that's it. Okay. Um Should I do I need to buy anything or Hi Pendleton. Hold on, I don't want to talk to you just yet. You, you sell me things. Corvo, my friend. Do you need ammunition or weaponry? Would you like me to craft something for you? Yes, please. Let's see, sleep bolts. Um, hmm. Let's take that and. Okay. I think we're good. Wait. Corvo, a moment if I may. For once so steeped in courtly manners, his thoughts do linger long on revenge and murder. Yeah, he seems he seems like a good guy. <laughs> the royal protector, Corvo. I've asked to speak to you myself. You see, I'm sending you to kill my older brothers, Morgan and Custis. They're horrible men. Well, it's with true, names like that. I mean, cruel. Well, words. maybe not Morgan, but Custis. Really, you have to further. Okay, sure. My not offer me any allies okay, fine, to fine. the Lord Regent, and as long as they are in Parliament, we cannot gather the votes we'll need to stop the Lord Regent from further consolidating his power. These days, they're best known for exploiting their favor with him to cheat others out of their wealth. Let's just say that. Not every family evicted in quarantine for having the plague actually has the plague. Ah, they're slumlords. I warned my lords. brothers okay. in every way I could. I really did. But they never did listen to me. They'll be at the Golden Cat tonight at their usual revels. They'll be protected by the city watch. So it'll be dangerous. Now I go. mean, I ran circles around Please them. Please do it before I change my mind. Well, no, I guess that was overseers mostly. Again, not gonna offer to... Share it? No? Okay. Hey, you. What are you doing over here? You seem suspiciously just standing here, Martin. Campbell's book appears to contain much more than we expected. He was blackmailing a number of highly ranked overseers. With the information in his journal, we will be able to manipulate the religious faction. The overseers will bend to our will. Yay for religious manipulation? Or manipulation of the religious. I'm not sure how that one works out. Either way, it helps us. Hey, what's up, Sammy? I'll take you to the Golden Cat when you're ready. I've taken Lord Pendleton enough times, believe me. I bet you have. Shadows give you a bonus to... Uh, okay. Distillery District. So, again, we are... I'm... Mm, distillery. Okay. I know one of the gangs has control of that area. And I specifically avoided them because I didn't want to risk glitching the game. I'm not sure if we can avoid them in this one or not. Let's find out. I'll get you as close as I can to the Golden Cat, Corvo. You 
You'll have to go the rest of the way on your own. The entrance is near Holger Square. The main thing is to make sure... I like that, like, that's right over there. That was the where we started the last mission. And we're just going... Oh, never mind. We're still going right over there. I thought we were going to go that way. Get inside the cat if you don't kill But that's not what's This happening. here's his territory. He and his Bottle Street gang hole up at the old Dunwall Whiskey Factory. They sell the elixir that folks use to fight off the plague. I'll lay low, but keep an eye out for you and the little lady you bring him back. Good luck to you. I know Emily must mean a lot to you. Yes. Be careful going up the street. Corridor. The world a lot. Overhand totally. I know, pulled up alongside me last night. That so came out sarcastic, but I want to rescue her. I like Emily. I guess you getting rid of Campbell shook up the Lord Regent. As as it should have. Um, I no, I like Emily. I like her in this game, and I especially like her seeing what happens to her in the second game. There's my crouch. There's my crouch. Okay. Um, and I don't have that ability to. Chaos. Your actions affect the city. A high number of deaths result in more rats and weepers. Different reactions from your allies and darker final outcomes. I believe we are still in low... Jesus, what the... Oh, it's... Okay. Why, why are they... Those people were just crossing a bridge. What the fuck? Okay, so we're not going across the bridge, is what I'm getting. Ollie, what are you doing? Um. Hold on one moment. I. Something. That just. You know, uh, just. Hold on. Alright, sorry about that. Um. Poor little Ollie got sick. Uh, I, I've, okay, I've never gotten a for certain thing on this, but every now and then, maybe once a year, he has this thing where he's sleeping, and then he'll wake up, and it seems like he's really dizzy, and he can't walk or anything like that, and then he throws up. And he was, the crashing noise that I heard was him falling off the couch and then trying to crawl his way across the kitchen to get to me. Uh, so I went upstairs, I got him outside just in time, and now he's down here with me, and he's wrapped up in a nice one of his favorite blankets and uh, I think I think we're gonna be okay but this is, that means this is the only episode I'm getting recorded tonight because after this uh, he gets all of my attention so uh, let's see what have we got we've got a lot of things wait what oh no never mind they're just point they're on the bottom of the screen pointing that direction they're not actually down on the bottom of the Oop. Hi there. Huh? Uh. Put that be that for that. You come here, come on. Get you out of the open. And of course there's nowhere over here to hide you. Okay. Huh what? What do you mean, huh? Huh? Nothing. No huh. No huh. No huh. Whoosh. We'll put you down here. You'll be that cozy down here, you know? Forgot I can't run when I'm carrying someone. What was that? Who's looking at me? Don't pay any mind to the guy carrying the, the guard. Still unconscious, good. Okay. Huh, huh, nothing. Stop. Attention, Dunwall citizens. Thaddeus Campbell, formerly High Overseer, is no longer a citizen of Dunwall. Yeah, no kidding, he's not. And by one of the oldest traditions of the Abbey of the Everhead, it is now a minor criminal You're just a man I suppose. Slackjaw's wanting to talk to you. Is he? 
Oh, crap. Okay. Um. Why? What a mess, huh? Whole town's gone to trash. Yeah. Mr. Thug. I I guess we're talking to Slackjaw. Is that him? Yeah, he's the one. Hey, we got a message for you from Slackjaw. He wants to talk at the distillery. Why? Oop, what do you what do you what do you what? Oh, just don't be threatening like that. Honestly. <sighs> the old Dunwall Distillery. Oh, this, this makes me nervous. Okay. There are things to collect, though. Now, oh, okay, I don't think that counts as being spotted. You know, I bet you, looking at this... Not anything to smoke or eat. Blow off, chopper. Yeah, chopper. Do that. Oh, I was right. There's stuff up here. Oh, look at... Okay. So he might want to talk to me. Somewhere? Where did he go? Over there. But there are things to explore. First. Although I guess we're not... Well, the only thing I care about, I guess, is the, the bone charm. I don't really care about runes, so... Since we're not playing that way... Don't die! Oof. There is a strong drink made here. I tried it once. Distilled from river crusts, but I tasted it. Ugh. The bite fish? Ew. Down there, you say, huh? I bet you that's locked, too. Um. Seems like a good opportunity for a new save. Yep, super locked. Hi, not gonna job be waiting for you. Okay. I'm gonna take these. But where might I find the key to get in there? That's what I wanna know. Easy, easy. You just need a bit. Elixir, three parts water down. Oh, that's just to make the swallow go smooth. Well, I ain't taking no chances on getting the plague. Drink till you drop. That's my motto. Okay. You're talking about alcohol still, or? Bunting. This art dealer, Bunting, is a man of taste. If anyone had left in Dunwall has something worth stealing, it's him. So whoever opens the safe gets double the normal cut. Slackjaw. Is that what we're here to do? Open the safe? I guess we just have run of the place, huh? Which makes me feel really unsettled, actually. I'm so used to sneaking. That's bright. That's too bright. Thank you. <coughs> Ignore me. I'm gonna put my super awesome sword away. Slackjaw. What's up? My men were right. You do look like a man out for murder. You don't know what I look like. You can't see my face. Look at your head collection. Hi. Way I figure it. There ain't nobody worth killing around here except those two Pendletons over at the Golden Cat. I'm right, ain't I? See. I can either confirm Slackjaw. nor deny this. Them boys are twins. Rich, mean, and weird. Worse than most of their ilk. They've been laying low there a while. Not sure why. 
There's a lot of security at the Golden Cat tonight, though. Special guests and the like. But you're gonna walk in there, dress like that, and kill the Pendleton brothers? Maybe not not the first plan. Not my first... That's not option A. For me first, understand. Someone, I don't know who, is killing my men, taking my territory, stealing my goods. Might be a fellow name of Galvani. I sent my best man to investigate, but he went missing and... Well, now I need someone to find what happened to him. Go to this Galvani's place. He lives nearby off Clavering Boulevard. Didn't we do that already? You do that for me and I'll get your better way into the Golden Cat. Were we not in Galvani's? Is he the doctor? Bootleg still instructions. Okay, well this would be useful if I planned on bootlegging alcohol, but I don't. I, what I want is keys. Do you have keys to that room? Right, we'll take that. Though. Ooh, and that. That I can. That's that's money. I'll I'll happily take that. All right, somewhere in here is a dang thing for that dang bone charm. I just don't remember where it's at. Lovely little prison cell you have here, though. Oh, that's so much stuff, too. How, how does one get in there if one were so inclined? Distillery reserve key. Okay, well, I guess, how about, whoop, come on, get, get, get. there we go. <laughs> grab a snack, grab a, uh, looting in recent months. Looting started in the warehouse. Once enough men took sick with the plague, the companies had to suspend operations. My husband Malchus was with the Mearson Tobacco. You know what? I don't care. <laughs> I don't care. All I want to know is how do I get in there? Through here. Do you have a key? <coughs> no. Okay, I'm not actually seeing a way in there. Except... Oh, the reserve key. I still need the reserve key. You the don't seem to have looking? one. Huh. You don't have one. Who has one? <coughs> the rats could get me in there, I bet. I bet you. They could. All right. Well, you know what? I think we're gonna call this one here. Um, I'm gonna have to double check and make sure this doesn't. This isn't one of those things that might bug the game out. I don't think it is. I think we're gonna be fine. I feel bad leaving without that uh, bone charm, but I'll have to get it next time around. Um. Or who knows, this will never see the light of day because this does bug the game and I reload the earlier save. I guess we'll find out. Thank you guys for hanging out and I'll catch you on the flip-flop.